everybody. Welcome back to Vampire the Masquerade, Clan Quest Mod, Bloodlines, Malkavian Run with Amara Ravenfire. How y'all doing? Uh, we just made it downtown and now it's time to go and tell the prince that we made the sabat go boom. Boom boom boom. Go boom boom ba doom ba doom. Sorry, call me. Which is apropos given that I am currently playing a Malkavian. Come on. Load. Oh dear lord. There we go. Every now and again it'll glitch and I'll have to do something about it, but... Actually, wait a minute. Get armor over here. Somewhere. Gotta get this way then. There's a dude at the end of one of these streets. What gives armor? Which is pretty cool. Oh, there he is. Yeah. No? One of these streets. One of these streets has good armor. But for now, we need to go and talk to Princey Poo. Prince McDouche. <laughs> Sorry about that. Hey, it's the dude. Snack cake? What are you doing here? I mean, I gotta admit, I'm a little flattered if you're stalking me, but, uh, Anyhow, uh, you see where your little security muffins ended up? Night shift lobby sergeant, huh? <laughs> hey, you stick with me, because I'm going straight to the top, baby. Ah, Jelly Donut. Allow me to climb the tower. Uh, I'd love to buzz you up, but according to Building Security Protocol 916, I'm going to have to verify that you're supposed to be here before I can open the elevator. I hate to be a Louis Law, but I'm new here, and uh, you don't get a second chance like this every day. Louis, the name I seek is Lacroix. Would that be Sebastian Lacroix of the Lacroix Foundation or Dwayne Lacroix of Insurrection Baby Formula Company? Sebastian Lacroix. Uh, okay then. Mr. Lacroix, he told me to expect someone fitting your description sometime tonight. You go right on up. Yeah, uh, you have a good power meeting or uh, whatever it is you types do up there. Do you need any security? Well, you just ring the front desk and ask for Officer Chunk. That's me, in case you were wondering. His name is Chunk. What are you a chunk of? Is there a bigger piece? Ah, yeah, I, I get that all the time. The name goes back to my football days. Oh, actually, uh, my fantasy football days uh, at the station. Stationarium, that was this office supply outlet mall I used to watch. Hey, you kids! No skating in the parking lot! <laughs> that was me. I will stitch your name into my brain. Farewell. I can walk through a metal detector despite carrying like 15 different weapons. That is entertaining. Alright, let's go see Prince Madouche. Look, oh, Prince Madouche and Magilla Gorilla. There you are. I was informed of your presence in the building. Oh, you Since you're here, here I'll take the liberty of assuming you've destroyed the warehouse. This is correct, yes? Boom. Most excellent. I had no doubt you'd prove my decision a prudent one. I trust you encountered no impediments to your progress on account of my personnel. Bloody Mercury, Two Faces, Diner, diner Assassins, Wolf People. Yes, yes, I'm sure it was quite an experience. You've done well, circumstances being what they were. I will admit, not many in your position would have overcome such a trial. I had to go blow up a warehouse. But it's don't not misunderstand that hard. me. It was no fool's errand. You may yet prove to be a genuine asset. <sighs> it's a bit disturbing the lack of talent within this organization as of late. Tell me, what would you say to doing a bit of reconnaissance for me? Dangle something in front of me. Don't be so hasty to inflate your own worth. You've succeeded once. Very admirable. But in the grand scheme of it all, an infant's stride of progress. If you're looking to make a name for yourself, 
Listen very carefully. There have been whispers, rumors spreading around the Kindred community Oof. concerning the Elizabeth Dane, the cargo ship that was towed into port recently. Have you heard of it? You hear them too? I mean, continue. The police are investigating the Dane as we speak. Even the Nosferatu have little information on what's been found. However, the reason the ship has caused such speculation is because it was transporting an object called the Ankaran Sarcophagus. Now, Mummies. I'm not one to predicate a decision based on conjecture, so what I need is fact. And more importantly, I need evidence that the occurrences on the Dane were not supernatural in nature. My eyes are up and here, no Prince way douche. relate to this Ankaran Sarcophagus. Why this one? Should I repeat myself? I do believe I mentioned the fact that I bent the delicate laws that govern our society to allow you a chance to live. If that isn't enough, I can't give you another reason. No, I passed your trial, now I pass from your sight. You will go to the Elizabeth Dane. I will go to the Elizabeth Dane. You have three objectives. One. I want you to examine the sarcophagus for anything unusual. You may sense something peculiar about the sarcophagus. In fact, many kindred in the city have reported an uneasiness in the air since the Dane's arrival. Do not, under any circumstances, open the Ankaran sarcophagus. Secondly, the police have begun their investigation. Find out what they have concluded thus far. Thirdly, take the cargo manifest for the ship. I want to find out what else it was carrying. The last thing we want is police aware of our existence, so be careful what you do in front of them. And unlike the warehouse, you cannot wholesale slaughter a ship full of lawmen without consequences. Is this understood? More than you know. Good. Oh, and it has come to my attention that you had an encounter with Nines Rodriguez earlier. The man so does love to throw that cretinous charm of his brashly about. What exactly did Mr. Rodriguez say? He wants me to find the last round in this field of massive rectangles. I see. Then, you should go humor the by-the-numbers rhetoric he's so desperately aching to spew. Or please, before the chance of fascist oppressor from that dive of theirs clog the air and choke the local kind. I am gone. Give the Anarch community my regards. <laughs> Good one. That's right. I got an achievement being dominated by the prince. Because he's a dick. You're a dick. Dick. That's right. I'm joining the Anarchs anyway, so he can fuck right off. He can fuck off. So done with his ass. Need a ride. Like father and child, I will ride as you drive. Down to Santa Monica again. And I'll deal with the Ankaran sarcophagus and then run around downtown and pick up some quests. That is what I shall do. Let's go see if maybe Mr. Tong knows anything. Get out of my way, you rude motherfuckers. Acquaintance of your golden I know you did. Sharp kid. Contract like a bloodhound. I watched him work for a while before I approached him. I had no idea how. Best in your brain that I would? I knew you would. I had him watching you know who for me. It was inevitable you'd pass through her joint. 
I told him to keep an eye out for you, gave him lines to feed you, the whole bit. But I vanquished the Asian nightmare in his stead. No, you helped me remove a spy without revealing myself or getting my hands dirty. Pretty good actor, that Knox, huh? Deception is the devil's game. Don't take it hard, Cupcake. I won't be the last elder to milk you for a favor. You know people, tell me. Sure. Tell me of the Jester, for instance. Jester? You call LaCroix a Jester? Uh, you die. The, the Anarchs. Yeah, I respect what they do, strenuous liberty and all that jazz, but they're kidding themselves. Wherever there's an ounce of power to be had, there'll be people dicking each other over. You think the Camarilla invented that? What do you know of the one with a number for a name? From what I hear, he's a likable sort, and that's a problem. Nines Rodriguez is the kind of guy you want on your side, and more kindred go anarch every day because of him. I see some, someone with my mind sure. by. Stop by my apartment, see what's over there, see if there's anything new, and then head down to the beach and go deal with things. Because, well, I don't think so. Confuse everything. in my Lacuna Cola poster. There's a new one. And it's Jeanette being creepy. It's a good thing I stopped the track. Now I have to go get a packet of vampire blood from the local clinic. No, not vampire blood, werewolf blood. done, get it over with, get it taken care of, and then move on to the Elizabeth Danks. That's going to be an episode unto itself, kind of like the Ocean House was, probably because I'm going to get lost. Okay. <laughs> 
Martin's room. Jesus, who is this guy? House? Can I see Hippocrates. Uh, hey, Arthur Kilpatrick. Serotinia so infection compounded by untreated herpes simplex 2. Ouch. Marsh. Frequent thoughts of sexlexia. Diseases. Is this guy even a doctor? Although actually those emails should have shown probably not. Administration. You could use for grandma. Uh, email. Lakers. Strange blood sample. Hey, Danny received an interesting blood sample from someone over at the Sun. I guess some freak told them it was werewolf blood. Can you believe this shit? Anyway, they're playing, paying us to run the numbers, so could you do it on your next shift? Many thanks, up dog. How the hell am I supposed to know what you're testing for? Get creative. It's not really a big deal. Just see if there's anything strange about it. Oh, yeah, sorry. The sample is in the electronic cabinet by the controlled substances. There we go. By the way, you don't have some hoops this weekend. Jesus, do you know anything? I had Phil change the password a few hours ago. The new password is the name of Malcolm's dirty little secret. Oops, did I say that? You better delete this thing when you're done. Uh, reading it, see you at the park Saturday morning. Okay. So, controlled substances is what I'm looking for. areas for hospital staff only. I am a key ring. Feed me, then you can't see You can me. let yourself out. Much thanks. CIS. <coughs> CIS. thing is, I use Obfuscate and um, it very much becomes a you can't see me moment. Nope, nope. 
that's a break room. Alright, well, so I'm gonna go blackmail a doctor. I'm sorry, miss, but you're gonna have to wait outside like everyone else. No exceptions. He's a doctor who likes to play doctor with his nurse. Get out of here! Can't you see I'm with a patient? Your malpractice things will interest your wife. Trying to blackmail me? You don't know who my wife is. She wouldn't believe you. Now get out! Perhaps Trina and Paige should trade doctor stories. Wait now. What do you want? 150. Deal. But I'm in the middle of something. I'll have to drop it off later. You'll never speak to me about that again. Drop my simoleons over by the place of pawns. Oh, well. Spiders. I'm a jerk. <sighs> should really stop sitting on my feet. They fall asleep so easily. I <sighs> 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 drop off the blood, the quad told me to go get. something break. It wasn't in my apartment. This is what I care about. Up in here. What is this? I'm used to it coming here. That's new and interesting. Oh, no, okay, okay. <laughs> Yay, mastery redeemed. Right. So we're going to go ahead and end this video here. I shall save this. I shall call it George. Alright, so this has been the Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines Clan Quest Malpigian Run for the Mara Ravenfire. If you liked the video, hit like. If you want to see more, hit subscribe. And I will catch you guys on the flip side. Good night and good luck.